Hey guys, it's Monique. Welcome back to my channel. How are you guys doing today? I have a plan with me in my B6 Traveler's Notebook. This is a Foxy Fix Chocolate Cherry in uh, number five, and which is also a B6. And yeah, so <clears throat> let me show you guys what kit I'm going to be using. And this is from Aria's Dray Daydream. Day dream lord have mercy and um it's personal size i believe and i got this from go wild and yeah so i'm going to be using it this week i'm going to be pulling in a lot of other stickers just to make sure that i have a complete um spread but i thought it'd be perfect for my traveler's notebook so yeah excited about that so let me show you guys how last week turned out. So we're just gonna pop this right on out of here. And yeah, so I'll zoom you guys in a little bit. And just a reminder that this kit was from Jameson Reed and I thought it came out absolutely lovely. It's so pretty and today is Friday so plan next week I'm definitely on track for that and this giant um, double box is stunning so yeah I've been keeping up with the dinners and stuff so yeah been keeping up with everything so I don't really have much going on this week um, I have a couple of birthdays I'm gonna celebrate my sister and my um my sister and my daughter because for some reason i can't remember i have a daughter but yeah so oh let me guys show you the washi and it's not simply gilded which is a shocker probably i'm using this one from the planet uh planet planner society and i just thought the peachy color kind of went with this like amber color it kind of complements and then the gold foil i thought it would look be nice with that as well and i'm also going to incorporate some other touches of gold foil so that's why i decided to go with this washi and it's nice to use a different washi once in a while because i have a lot of washi so using it up makes me feel good but anyway i'm going to switch over the voiceover mode and let's get so now I am laying down the bottom washi and again this washi is from the Planner Society and I decided to switch it up and use something different but it still has gold foil on it so still sticking with the foil theme there with the washi but it is really nice just nice like I said before to use up something different since your girl has a lot of washi. I'm just getting that situated. Oh my gosh, I, I cannot believe that we are already in February. And it's just like every day there's something new going on. Um, the Black Women Who Plan and Create, they announced that their tickets are going on sale at the end of the month or beginning of March, depending on if you were a member, if you went before or not. So have that going on. Anyway, now I'm adding these rose color day date dots to the simply watercolor co date covers so um i know it's a little hard to see on top of the deep purple but i guess they do kind of show up in the in the light there you can kind of see the the light catches them you can see the foil but it's cute i really enjoy these date covers and i definitely use them a lot I think I'm going to try to um, purchase a lot of mini kits going forward so that would really um, uh, have a, me have a need for the um, date covers because the mini kits, uh, some of them, a lot of them that I've been looking at don't have date covers and I love date covers so yeah. Now I am taking this sticker from the Erin Condren sticker book. I don't remember which one it was from but... I am using this one and it says make yourself proud and it is very nice. Okay, so yeah, like I was saying, it was from, I'm using the sticker strip right here. And these are like, I guess if you had a personal um, planner, 
you would use these for the border, but I'm just cutting them up and using them for various different things in this spread. I really made a good use out of them, so I'm just happy about that. I'm using a This Week sticker, and I believe that is from Little Miss Papery. So I definitely pulled in a lot of different spreads here. So now I, I mean a lot of different spreads, a lot of different shops, I will say. <laughs> Not spreads, but shops. And now I am adding the full box down here. And I had to fix it because I totally like laid it down there wrong. But y'all know I am like the queen of putting things down crooked, but who cares, right? <laughs> anyway, I'm just trying to alternate between like the amber and the purple color in the full boxes. And actually, this kit did not have enough full boxes, so you'll see what I'm going to do here on the weekend. After I add the last full box that I had, I am now going to take the sidebar strip and make a full box. Um, I thought this was a really cool idea. I actually kind of got this idea from, I forget her name. Her name is Lisa, but it's like... Much Her channel name is way longer than Lisa, but I can't remember the whole thing at the present moment. But she did this with, with regular washi, and um, she made a full box. And I thought that was a pretty cool idea. And I think she said she got it from Once More With Love or Coffee Monsters Co., one of the two. But either way, I thought it was a cool idea. And it solved my whole needing that last full box. So everything is uniform so now I'm just adding these glitter headers that came with the kit and I think these look really cute I decided to go with the same color for the Monday through Friday so I really like that and now I'm adding in these quarter boxes I'm going to use the quarter boxes to put down my um, schedule for the week my work schedule I really really like having my work schedule in my planner I got that from using my hourly definitely helps when you have things going on during the week and how do you decide what and how and where and all that stuff you're gonna do things so that's why I like it so I'm using these work stickers from Libby and Co and also the little purple house stickers are from there as well I think maybe that clip may have gotten cut out I'm not 100% sure but I don't see where I would have laid them down but I promise you guys it was there at some point but anyway now I'm adding in the to clean checklist to add in my zones and then putting a little um I think it's a vacuum cleaner icon in there again I can't remember 100% but I do believe that's what it is and now I'm just adding in the zones that I have to focus on this week and I wanted to just touch on a minute with the zones. Oh, again, I'm using the sticker strips again to just use some separation there. But on the zones, it's like I don't just clean that stuff when it comes up, but it's like I kind of focus on a deeper clean. So that's what that's there for, just to throw that out there. Now I'm using a glitter header. And the rest of that full box, the rest of that check heart, check heart list for my YouTube videos so that's what I'm doing there and now I am adding in the habit trackers I need two so I'm adding them in and now I'm doing that so I have my medicine and the homework that I'm tracking and now I'm adding in these three heart checklists that came with the kit and I'm using those for my to-do list for the week so I really really like that a lot it looks really well and it's nice I like the colors okay guys I'm adding in the last two checklists on this side of the page and now I am going to alternate the glitter checklist across the um, the, the glitter headers across across the heart checklist uh, that was like a mouthful to say so just because I think in out of each color there's only five there aren't seven of each color so um, it just made sense to alternate them through here and as you guys will see on the next page I'm going to continue to alternate them but also the Saturday and Sunday header at the top is going to be a different color from the one that is Monday through Friday because again 
I only had five of each color. So I had to make it work some kind of way. And now I'm using from the Happy Planner that just do your your um just do your thing sticker for the happy thought box and I'm using this Monday through Sunday tracker and the dinner headers from Little Miss Papery adding that in there and again using the washi sticker strips to fill in that space there at the bottom getting my little ruler out so I can make sure I do this cut straight and again like I was saying this is really a good idea to add that in filling up the space so now I'm just adding in the garbage days and those little garbage cans are from Alexi Kylie and now I'm adding a time to plan sticker for Friday because that's usually when I try to do my plan with me and now I'm adding in this appointment label for the Bible study so I'm putting that in and that open book is from Chrissy and Designs and then I'm just adding in the priorities for the week, which is my way in. And I have to go to the bank for some savings stuff. So I'm adding in icons for all of that. And yeah, I added those in. I really, I added the touch of orange with some of the icons because I thought they looked really nice. Now I'm adding in these half boxes because I'm going to put down my daughter and my sister's birthdays. They are a day apart. Well, not in years, but their birthdays are a day apart. So I'm adding in all of that lovely info. And I'm using these little scribblers. These are the old school scribblers from Scribble Friends Co. And I absolutely love these. I forgot what that girl's name was. But anyway, I have those. I think it was Olivia, but don't quote me on that. I might be wrong. Now I'm adding in the half box for the Sabbath service and just adding in the scriptures that we will go over on Saturday and if you guys hear any background noise behind this voiceover I apologize because my son is like extra crunk today um yeah but I'm just trying to get this done okay guys that weekend banner is from playing with Anna and this is my finished spread guys thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video bye